I've been outside all day today. Temperatures are really starting to rise here in the deep south. And um, I, so I've come in for water and a snooker break. Okay, break's over, back to work. So what I wanted to share with y'all today is my basil plants. Now, the last time I showed you guys my basil plants, I had um, harvested off of them. So, it's been a little while since I've harvested them, and I've already been out here working on them, and I thought, ooh, I need to do a video on this. So, what I wanted to show you was this, right back here. Well, this right here, flowers on basil. Now, I had a guest over not long ago and we were I was pinching the flowers off and she began to question that and I said, "Yeah, the flowers are not good. Um they're going to make your plants not grow." And she did not know that. And there was a time that I didn't know that either. So, this flower is going to Cause my this stem to stop growing. This flower has told my plant to stop growing and make seeds. And that's not what I want to happen. So I'm going to take this off. I'm just using my fingernail. You can use scissors if you need to. You wanna gently do that. And you can see I have some more. So I spent the first little bit of time right in here and went in for a break and I thought that would be a good video um, to do because a lot of people will see these flowers and think their plants are doing great and they are, but you don't want these, you don't want your plant to put all its time and energy in making seeds because then it's gonna stop growing. And you want your energy of your plant to gonna go to go into your leaves. So when you see these flowers, you just want to gently take them off because you want your leaves to grow and get more flavor. These little pieces right here are trying to make seeds, so you'll just take those off. And it's that simple. That keeps your plant growing. It keeps it healthy. And many more days of basil. So happy homesteading, y'all.